What's up, YouTube? I'm back again with another video, and uh, this time it's on another Jodak Men number 15 cologne. And this is our version of Tommy for Men by Tommy Hill figure. And um, I bought this to y'all before, I think, in a lineup, but not I don't think I bought it to y'all in a separate video by itself. So here we go, I'm bringing it back, and um. Uh, Pretty sure y'all know what this smell like. It's been around here since the, I want to say mid, early to mid 90s. Uh, Tommy Hill figure were popular in that day. And uh, check out the sprayer. This only costs a dollar now. Check out the sprayer. Pretty good sprayer. Sprays a lot. One more time on the sprayer. Sprays a lot, guys. For a dollar, pretty decent sprayers. I seen the spray was better than Sonic cost thirty and forty dollars in my opinion. So it just that's how they get you. Alright, what this basically smells like to me, it smells more of leathery. Uh this smells leathery, woozy, and it's got like mint in there. It's got kind of like a mint smell. That's the dominant notes in this. In my opinion, it might be a tad bit of fruitiness, but it's, it's very distant, in my opinion. But this, if Tommy Hill figure the original, it smell more like, uh, like I said, it's leathery. It's got mint and it's woods. But it's a good smell, you know. Uh, I wore this when I was in the real. I had the Tommy Hill figure cologne, Tommy in high school. I think that was like in the mid nineties, late nineties, like ninety seven, ninety six, ninety seven. I was a freshman then, like 97, somewhere up and down. I was a freshman in high school. I had flunked a grade, though, so I was supposed to have been there like 96. I would have been a freshman in 96. 96 or 97, I would have been a freshman in high school. And I used to wear this, and um, what it smelled like then was more like a mint. Uh, if I can remember, it was mint. It's kind of got the woods in this. It's got a little... A little bit of undertones are leathery, but it mostly mint. It's got some leathery and wizzy, like you know, it's about distant fruit in there, also. But ladies love this stuff in high school. This Tommy Hill figure was very popular. The women used to love the cologne when I wore it, uh, even to this dollar cologne right here. It smells amazing, guys. I highly recommend it. Uh, you can't go wrong with it because, like. Like I said, you only got a dollar in it, so it smells amazing. Uh, I got this, I think it was Dollar Tree, so you head out every time a dollar and just scoop this stuff up, man. Like I said, I only call, as you can see, I wore the heck out of this. Look here, ain't much of that left. <laughs> this stuff is smells amazing, so you know, that tell y'all something right there. As you can see, that majority of it is gone. So, you know I've been wearing it. So, good cologne. Pretty good, pretty good. So, ain't too much more to say. Basically, like I said, what it smells like to me is more mint. It's got kind of leathery. It's got mint up in there. But it smells amazing, guys. It's got distant fruit also up in there. But um, the longevity and the projection of this is pretty decent. Also, it um, lasts about two to five hours, give or take. Uh, you know, for a dollar, you know, you can just reapply. You know, it ain't going to last the longest for the price that you got in this. So, you know, all the thing you basically have to do is reapply. You know, for a dollar, you can spread all you want to. <laughs> and the only thing, like I said, it really count. Uh, long your lady like it, your girlfriend like it, your wife like it or whatever like that. That's all that counts. So no matter about what it costs. Smells a smell. I don't care if it costs a dollar or it costs two hundred dollars. It's still just a smell. Alright. So guys, once again, hope y'all enjoyed this little review. This has been a review of our version of Tommy Hill figure for men by Jodak. Number 15 for men. Alright. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see y'all on the next video. Peace out, YouTube.